Monica has a question about applying for disability, so let's get into that. Her question says, I have Sjogren's and fibromyalgia, and I would like to know if it's possible to get permanent disability. I'm going to share my take on this, and if you have uh, advice to give, drop it in the comments. Also, if we haven't met, my name's Heather. I'm a chronic illness and disability advocate, and I come on this app to try and help other people in our community. This is the recommendation that I give to any patient who is currently struggling to work and wants to apply for a government disability program or a workplace disability program. First thing you need to do is have a doctor that is on your side. So whether that's your GP or your rheumatologist, um, they are going to have to fill out paperwork on your behalf to talk about what your condition is and how it impacts you. As a patient, one of the things that I would have ready to go when it comes to communicating with your doctor and filling out the paperwork for disability is to talk about what your quality of life was like before you got sick and how your illness and the symptoms that you deal with daily impact your day-to-day -day life. It matters less about the diagnosis and more about how your illness is impacting your day-to-day. -day. So things like, can you get yourself dressed? Can you feed yourself? Can you keep up with house chores? Can you take care of your children? Can you bathe yourself? If you have difficulty doing any of, the, any of these things now that you're sick, explain that. If you have to hire help to come into your house to help you, explain that. If you have an inability to function because of fatigue, explain that. Even better if you have statistics of seven days out of a month, I am completely incapacitated and bedridden. Five days out of the month, I am able to get out of bed but cannot leave my own house, etc., etc. If you're not already journaling these sorts of symptoms and the impacts that it has on your body, start today. Literally just grab a pen and paper and start writing what you are at right now and then continue to journal forward, whether that's daily, weekly, or monthly, in a way that you will be able to communicate that with your doctor and with either an insurance company or a government disability program. If you have follow-up questions, please drop them in the comments.